Welcome inside of the Ganapi Record Recreation Complex. This is the third game in as many days for the Adam AAA Toros. They're trying to end on a high. They split the first two. They're beating Peterborough on Friday. They fell to Markham yesterday. 4-1. to one. So now they get their focus on the York Simcoe Express. And it'll be Christian Thomas in goal and Arniatis in goal for York Simcoe at the other end. Put it in behind the net. York Simcoe tries to get it out of their own end to start things off. Getting around McCaslin for the first opportunity. Is skating in with Swirla. Getting it there for Nicholson with a shot. That'll go in wide as they hit a stick. Chipping it off the boards. Nice play there by Swirla who chips it deep into the zone. Now it's Keaton Ardow with the puck. Ardow's got to get around the checker there of number four. Puts it back in behind the York Simcoe net, if we just started off here in the game. Some nice offensive pressure there in behind the goal to try force a turnover by Kadiklo. Puts it behind the net. From their own end, they try and bounce it off the boards for Nicholson, but it stays in the zone, and it's an opportunity to set it up in front that gets taken aside. Baker still digging away at it over there at the other side. Picked up here and brought in by the York Simcoe Express. That'll go past Dwyer into the corner by Russo. Russo picking it up there in the zone here. These two teams have met once already. The York Simcoe Express won that one. No, they played twice and both, both games went to York Simcoe, I believe. Boys going after the puck there in the zone. Trying to get it over there to the other side here for a turnover. Owen Dobbs from behind the net. Trying to set things up in front. Luke Boys from behind the goal. Getting it for Legacy. At front there for Dobbs, but couldn't shoot the puck. But Dobbs will pick that one off. Back in behind the net for Legacy again. Legacy tried to jam it in from the side. Boys was waiting out in front. Trying to get it back to the line for Nolan Lee. Lee a shot. That gets knocked down on the way through by the defense. Luke Boyce chasing after the puck there in the corner with Legacy. Legacy gets free. Dobbs is waiting out of front. Tapping his stick for a pass. Back there for McCaslin. McCaslin shot. That'll go in wider than that. And it'll be an opportunity to come back numbers the other way. Nolan Lee trying to stick to his man. And he will as he caused a turnover there against Martin. Legacy had it in his feet. Dobbs takes it now. Owen Dobbs dumps it deep. It goes wide. From behind the goal they go with York Simcoe. Fired back in behind the net. Off the boards to come up through center. It is Ethan Sterling trying to stick to his man. Here comes an opportunity with a shot. They had a stick on the way through. Nice stuck there by Dwyer who blocked the shot. Now he's got a stick to his man. Taken aside there by Blake DeBow. DeBow and Brandt coming away now. Blake DeBow cuts in through the center. Got taken off his feet there before he could shoot the puck though. DeBow is waiting at the front as he's back on his feet. Looking for a pass at the front. It goes back to the line instead. To the other side for Dwyer. A shot will be fluttering in on the way through. Riley Brandt's going to touch it up on a high stick. Face off 1K by Keaton Arda. Ethan Sterling dumps it deep into the York Simcoe in. Pressured on, moves it back there to the other side as they look for a lane to get it out, but the Toros pick that one off, take it into the corner. Arda trying to help there on the other side. Shot from Dwyer. Tip the front. Shot! And a big save there by Arnie Addis. From behind the goal it goes. Riley Brink gets it. Back to the line for Dwyer. Dwyer a shot. Tipped at the front, stopped by Ernie Otis, and he's got it. Face off off to the left of the York Simcoe end. Winning the battle in the corner is Adam Baker trying to get it back to the line for McCaslin. Taken away from him, and back comes York Simcoe using the boards. It's going to be Martin with it. Martin thrown into the net, and it goes over the stick there at the other side. 
Toros can't get it out though as Jackman couldn't chip it past his man. Picking it up now is Martin. Trying to shoot that puck. He got knocked off it by there by Cooper McCaslin. Around the boards. Kept in by Bell with a shot. It hit a Toros player on the way through and that is going to try and get kept in but Bell couldn't hold the line. Martin coming after it now. York Simp goes in offside there but Backhanded in, knocked down on the way through. It's gonna skimmer all the way into the Toros end here for McCaslin. Under five minutes left to go here in the first period, still tied at nothing. Lead pass, trying to get around his man. That'll go down the ice. Trying to catch up to it there is Dobbs, but he's not gonna beat his man to the puck. Around the boards it goes. Dobbs again is gonna be there. Nolan Lee with the puck at center. Trying to chip it in deep and behind the York Simpco net. Legacy putting pressure on there at center, so it gets dumped down into the corner here behind the Toros net. Around the other side to try and get it back to the line here for Swirla. Swirla's trying to keep it in his feet and get another face off while the Toros are trying to dig it out of their own end. Here's a shot there from Rennie that goes wide of the net. Dwyer picks it up off the boards. Can't get it out. Here's Swirla. Swirla getting it there to the other side. Boyce tried to stick to his man. There's Legacy from behind the goal. Nice move to get it over there for Dobbs. Can't get it past Rinny though. Legacy picks it up. Keaton Legacy with the puck. Tries to get through to the center. Splits the D. Walks in. Sets it up in front. Just over the stick. Kept it by McCaslin though. Cooper McCaslin with a Bouncing puck and it doesn't make it through to the net. Back comes York Simpson with some numbers back up the other way but poked off the stick by Ethan Sterling. Sterling does another good job by knocking that down. Forsey tried to get to the puck there in the zone. So I forget. At the front, opportunity, shot. Nice block at the front that hit Sterling on the way through. Boys trying to get it out now. Luke Boys finds the puck, dumps it down and that will go for icing. Face off off to the left of Christian Thomas. It goes behind the net now. Taken aside there by Keith Nardo, fires it up. It'll be there to the other side for Riley Brandt to chase it away through center. Picked up here by Sterling in his own zone. Strong backhand there into the offensive end. It'll be McCauley firing it to the other side. Blake DeBow cuts it off. So now York Simcoe take it behind the net where Riley Brandt tries to stick to his man. Knocked down here by McCaslin. It's our first penalty coming up here of the game. And it's going to go to Blake DeBow. Face off deep off to the right of Christian Thomas around the boards. Baker trying to get it out. He does. Adam Baker's got to rush after the puck now to get it. Baker tried to Get her on the defender. York Simco took it away. And then in comes Stewart with a shot. Left pass save. Loose puck at it front. That's going to get jammed behind the goal. Stewart waiting at it front again for a pass. But it's a nice play there by Murray over there to the side shot. And they score from the side of the net. That doesn't take long for the power play to convert for York Simco to make it one to nothing. The goal goes to number 13, Cripps, on that shot that went over the right pad of Thomas. Hudson Bishop from his own end uses the boards smartly as it gets chipped in. Here comes Ethan Jackman. Jackman gets around the defender, walks it out. Shot just wide of Arniatis. Kept in here by Dwyer. Shot to the net. Tip. They score! Adam Baker, I think, tipped that puck as it makes it past Arniatis. To make it 1-1. One, one. Let out the beast, feel the power increase. I play for keeps, ain't nobody stopping me. Yeah. Let out the beast, feel the power increase. Come on. I play for keeps, ain't nobody stopping me. Let out the beast. It was a seeing eye shot from Zane Dwyer. I don't know if Baker got a stick on it or not. And that's going to tie things up here at 1 with 110 left to go. 
Behind the net it goes. Tapped in behind the net. Coming around the boards here for Dobbs. Owen Dobbs gets it away from the checker and flight fires it away at center. Knocked down by Bishop in his own end. We've reached the last minute of play here in period number one. So it was Cripps that got things started with a power play goal by York Simcoe, but the Toros come right back on a shot from the line that's able to beat Arnie Otis. Still a judgment call whether it was tipped out in front or not. We'll find out on the GoPros later on. Trying to walk that in, out in front. Trying to go to the backhand and Nolan Lee with a nice defensive play to push him wide behind the net. Back there to the line. It's gonna be Rennie who fires it behind the net now. McCaslin takes it aside, gets it up there for Owen Dobbs who tries to chip it out of his own end past Rennie. Coming around the other side now for Boys. Luke Boys with the loose puck, just skates it away here at center, dumps it down the ice, and it's not gonna go for icing. That is gonna do it for period number one. So the two goal scorers, once again was Cripps for York Simcoe, and then it was either Baker or Dwyer who tied things up for the Toros. Face off from center to kick off period number two. Sterling tries to dump it off the boards to get it in the zone. Arda trying to get around the checker. It goes into the corner. Coming around the other side, it's going to be picked off here by number 15 to try and get around Dwyer from behind the net. Taken aside by the throws as they'll try and jam it up in front here for Blake DeBow to get it out of his own end. Picked up now by York Simpko as they take that puck to the back of the net. They'll wrap it around with some nice play. Now it'll be an opportunity to shoot. Nice take away there by Keaton Ardo who gets bumped off the puck. But the Toros get it with the bow. Riley Brandt trying to get it in the zone. From behind the net, De Ardo with a nice play. The bow as well trying to get the puck from behind the net. Around the boards it goes. Sterling's gonna keep that one in as he pinches in. Ethan Sterling pinned there in the corner. The bow is helping him out to try and get it free. It goes back to the line for Ethan Sterling with a shot that goes in wide. Arda tried to stick to his man. Nice play by Bishop. Held it in. Debeau trying to stick to him. Riley Brent tried to poke it away from him. Up off the boards. And it's going to be brought in and fired wide at the Toro's net. McCaslin fires it around the other side. Trying to chip that puck out. Nice play to chip it free out of his own end. Now it comes free again. And here comes Riley Brandt with the puck. He'll take a slapper to the front of the net that gets blocked on the way through. Coming around the other side. Kept in here by McCaslin, but he lost control of the puck, though. Over here for Forget. Forget had a puck knock off a stick there by Bishop. McCaslin doing the job here for the Toros on defense. Takes it behind the net. Gets it back there for Bishop. Around the other side now for Cadiculo. It's still loose from the side front of the net, taken away as they hit a stick on the way through. Kept in by York Simko, who put it behind the net. Trying to jam it in from the side. Nice play to chip it away from number 96 before he could shoot it to the net. Cadiculo trying to stick to him. There's Pinella. Pinello. Swirlo with a shot. That'll get kicked out with the left pad of Christian Thomas into the left corner from behind the net for Bishop. From behind their own net, Bishop's got to race after the puck to try and get there first. But it's the Toros that get it and flip it up here for Adam Baker. Here comes Ethan Jackman to try and get away from the checker. Cooper McCaslin almost lost the puck, but he was able to regroup himself and get it out. Baker doing the job there on the other side. Brought in here for York Simcoe to try and get it back there to the line for number 14. Taking off a stick and trying to fire it around. That'll come away at center. Back up comes Ethan Jackman. Jackman cuts in. He's getting his shot go, but taking off his feet at the last second. Ethan Jackman again taken down with no penalty. Now it gets picked up there by Pinello and dumped out. Pantillo. 
Dumps it down the ice. Not enough for icing. Nolan Lee gets it from his own end. Goes back in behind the net. There's an opportunity that's not converted at the side of the goal. No one Lee with it. Gets it over there for Baker. Baker trying to get it up there for Keaton Legacy who gets it. Legacy's cutting in with a shot. Easy save there for Arnie Otis. Cripps is trying to get it. McMullen away at center with a nice pass. Tape to tape. And now he's trying to cut in past Lee but no one Lee blocked him off. Pushes them wide behind the net. Here comes an opportunity for a shot. Stopped there this time by Thomas. And he's going to jump on his own rebound. A face-off deep. One there in their own end. Tried to take it there to the net, but it was taken off the stick at the last second around the boards here for Owen Dobbs. Dobbs with a nice play to chip it out of his own zone. Over the stick here for Nolan Lee. Drops it back there to the line for Dwyer. Zane Dwyer from his own zone will fire it around the other side now for Dobbs. Owen Dobbs, couple of whacks away at the puck to try and get it free. It finally comes free here for York Simcoe as they try and get it to the center ice position. Nice play there by Dobbs to cut him off. But it gets kept in again there at the line and this skipping puck makes its way through to Forget who puts it in to make it 2-1. Face off one there by York Simcoe Perso tried to get it in the zone. Brought in here. They've got a man to beat. It's McCaslin. It goes behind the net again for Martin. Martin from behind the goal. Lost control of the puck and the opportunity to try and chip it out of his own end. Arda picks it up. Keaton Arda with a pass that gets picked off there at the last second. Perso couldn't go with the puck here. Now it's going to be Martin again who brings it in. Taking off his stick. Back up the other way with a lead pass. Knocked down on the way through by Bell who brings it in over the line. Bell cuts in. Bell shot. Stopped there this time by Thomas as he corrals it in his armpit. Face off off to the right of the Toro's end. Trying to throw it out of front. It'll be an opportunity to try and chip it free out of the zone. Batting away at it, there was Riley Brandt to try and get it out. Couldn't do so. That had a player on the way through. It's going to be Zane Dwyer from behind his own net. Lost his footing as they try and set things up in the zone. There's a shot to the front of the net. Taken aside there by York Simcoe. Turnaround shot. Left pad saved this time by Thomas. Now it's Bishop trying to fire it around. Can't get it out of his own end as it got kept in there by McMullen. Dwyer gets the opportunity now to fire it around. Gets it past the linesman as Brant can't chip it out over the line this time. Pressured on behind the net was Bishop. Bishop getting there to the other side for DeBow. Trying to go now is Keaton Arda. Arda is cutting it. Try to get through but couldn't do it. He had it knocked off his stick at the last second. Kept in by Blake DeBow. DeBow. Trying to win that battle in the corner. It's going to be a penalty coming up. And it's going to be for slashing. Face off off to the right of the toes end. It's DeBow that goes for slashing. Jackman gets taken down with no penalty there at the line. Trying to move it in over the line now. It's an opportunity to try and set it back to the net now for... Here's a shot scooped up there on the bounce by Christian Thomas. Defensive faceoff. It's going to be Arnie Otis. Arnie Otis to the other side. Here comes an opportunity now for McCauley who drops it off. From the faceoff circle, he's going to try and shoot this. And he scores from the side of the net to make it 3-1. Face off here from center. Kudeklo moves it over there to the other side. Bell's going to dump it deep back in behind the net. Trying to get the puck there on the other side to try and get it out of the zone. It'll be over there in the corner for Dwyer. St. Dwyer fires it off. 
That almost hit the linesman on the way through. Gets another opportunity to chip it out of the zone. Nice play at the line to hold it in by Bell. They've got a man sitting at the front there. Now Kudeklo tries to get to the puck to get it out. Chips it up through center. Taken into the boards. Again with no penalty. Pantillo comes in over the line. Drops it off there for Martin. Who's going to leave a drop pass. Taken aside here by the Toros and out. And Dwyer trying to get to the puck here. To try and get away from his man. Got it up there. And fired out down the ice. And it's going to go all the way down for icing. Face off one by York Simcoe with a shot to the front of the net. It'll skip in wide from behind the goal to try and fire it around. Kept in here by McMullen. McMullen tried to throw it to the front of the net. It goes behind the goal from McCaslin now. Trying to chip it out of his own end. As Owen Dobbs on the other side. Dobbs is doing a good job there to try and get it free. But it comes out of the zone. Over there to the other side now for McMullen. Turnaround shot that's not going to make it through. Dobbs is going to try and get to it. Goes back to the line. Over the stick there and out. It's going to go in wide of the York Simcoe net. Coming around the other side now. Is going to be number 15 with a pass over there to the other side to try and get through. They've got a man, Cripps, going to the front of the net. But that pass isn't going to make it through there. Trying to chip it out of the zone there was... Uh, Boys in the left corner. Kept in here by McMullen with a shot tip. Stopped there this time by Thomas. Swirla throws it out in front and it's taken aside there by the Toros. Bishop gets it from behind his own net, slaps it around. Dobbs trying to chip it out of his own zone, couldn't do it. Still there in the feet area to try and get it free. But again, picked off there by York Simcoe with a shot. Blocker saved this time by Thomas. But Castling gets it. Around the boards it goes. Trying to get it out off the left side. Stripped off the puck by Boys. Turn around to front of the net. Shot. And a big save there this time by Thomas. As he came across on the one-timer. Face off off to the right of the goal. Thrown to the front of the net. It's going to be forget from the side of the goal. Can't tip that puck home. Trying to get it out of his own end. We have 4.30 left to go here in the second period. York Simcoe are up 3-1 to one as they've added another one here in the second period. Shot! Not going to make it through. It hit his player on the way through. Now it is going to be trying to get it there against Nicholson. Here's Auda. Keaton Auda cutting in. Shot by DeBow. Riley Brent! Arnie Otis makes a save. Loose puck, they score! First one won't get you. The second one will. It's garbage day on Sunday for Riley Brandt. And it's 3-2. Let out the beast, feel the power increase. I play for keeps, ain't nobody stopping me. Let out the beast, feel the power increase. Come on, I play for keeps, ain't nobody stopping me. Let out the beast. First shot got stopped by Oniotis, but good play there by Brent to follow up on his own rebound. It was able to squeak it past him to, to uh, push this to a one goal lead at three to two. Wrap around out of front. That's not gonna make it through to the net. Toes pick it off, go for that lead pass through center. Here comes DeBow at center ice. Blake DeBow with a pass over there to the other side. It's going to be Bell taking it off the boards. It's a lead pass now for Martin who tries to bring it in. Goes back to the line again for Bell. McCaslin from his own zone fires it back in behind the net there for Sterling. Ethan Sterling with a pass to try and get it out of his own end. Arda couldn't get it out of there. There's a shot that's going to get bounced in there to Thomas who makes a stop. Face off will be off to the left of the Toro's end. From behind the, behind the net is Sterling. <coughs> Around the boards for Baker for Jackman. Jackman trying to get away. 
He gets away from the checker. He walks in with a pass that's out of the reach. Defenseman took Arniotis down. Torres got it out of front. Can't bury it out of front of the goal, but it's going to be Adam Baker. Baker and Cadiclo digging at it. Coming free now from Murray. Can't got it out of the zone. Now he tries to get away from Sterling. McCaslin loses control of the puck. He's going to walk in. Loses it at the side of the net. Coming around the boards again for the Toros. Trying to fire it out the boards to get it out. Over the stick. Opportunity to go now. And it's going to be Rennie from his own end. Pressured on there by Jackman. Ethan Jackman with a turnover there. It goes back and behind the net. Trying to walk it out. Couldn't, be couldn't bury it. Now Forget gets it. Forget gets stood up there by Ethan Sterling and we're getting a penalty. Penalty goes to Kadek Low. York Simcoe goes back to the power play with a 3-2 lead. Walking out, stopped there by Thomas Redding. And oh, it's in the net. And it makes it 4-2 York Simcoe. So it was a four minute penalty, so Kadiklo stays in the box. Arnie Addis comes up through center. Bringing it over the line. It's gonna be Swirla setting it back to the line there at the blue line. Coming away now for the Toros is Blake Debeau. Trying to start a two on net, one now with Kid Narda. Debeau shot, stopped there by Arnie Addis with the blocker hand. Martin will take this defensive draw here for York Simcoe. Won by the Toros in the offensive end for Bishop. Hudson Bishop to the front of the net. It hit the player of York Simcoe on the way through. Pantillo had it knocked off a stick there nicely by Bishop. Trying to get away from the checker now is Blake Debeau. Debeau muscles away from Pant Pantillo. Takes it behind the net. Brousseau is trying to hold Debeau. Debeau walks out with some nice moves, finally knocked off a stick. Then taken down out in front of the net, right in front of the referee's eyes. Pass over there to the other side. Dwyer trying to stick to his man there in the zone. St. Dwyer doing a good job from behind the net. Stuffing it in from the side of the goal to try and shoot it. Goes back to the line with a shot. Stopped there by Thomas on the way through. Over here to the other side now for the Toros to try and chip it out. It's going to be an opportunity here for Martin. Fans on it. Gets it back again. Now it's McMullen with a shot. That one's going to get stopped there by Thomas. And a loose puck that goes through the crease area. Dwyer from behind the net. Isn't going to get the puck. It's going to get covered up there by Thomas at the side. Face off, off to the left. Toros get the only penalty out of that. Dwyer goes to the box. Two man advantage for York Simcoe with a two goal lead. And there goes the final buzzer to end the second period. Now the Toros are down a coach as well as Sean Cochran's out of the game. <clears throat> Referees don't have names on their jerseys, but you can clearly see the name Hero on the back of this one. Face off off to the left of the Toros end. Brought in here by York Simcoe with a backhand that goes high and wide behind the goal. Capped in here by York Simcoe. Got it back to the line from McCauley. McCauley with a shot that doesn't make it through. From behind the net is Nolan Lee who takes his man into the boards. Around here for Cooper McCaslin to try and get it out. York Simcoe spin away from the checker. Trying to shoot that puck and hit the side of the net. McCaslin trying to stick to his man. From behind the goal it goes to the other side here for Nolan Lee. Trying to get it past McCauley there. Taken into the boards from behind the net. 
trying to jam it in from the side. It's a wrap around out of front for a quick shot. Stopped there by Thomas. And it's going to be from the side of the net now to try and wrap it around. Trying to set things up here for Nicholson. Back to the line here for McMullen. McMullen back over there to the other side with a shot. Shot! Nice stop there by Thomas with the blocker hand this time. McCauley a shot. Right pad save as it goes behind the net. Back to the line it goes. Over here to the other side to the faceoff circle. Spinning away from Jackman to try and cut it out. With a shot. That gets stopped there by Thomas. And jumped in at the side of the net to make it 5-2. McCaslin goes to the box after the York Simcoe goal. No, oh, only thing the referee is missing is a silver platter because he's handing this game to York Simcoe on a silver platter. Kept in here by Swirly with a shot and a left pad saved there by Thomas. Face off off to the left of the goal. Trying to fire it out. Gets kept in here. Martin a shot. Blocker saved there by Thomas. Bishop fires it around the other side. Gets kept in here by Brousseau. Back in behind the net there for Bishop. Fired back in behind the net. Hudson Bishop. Taken away from him out in front. Stopped there at the side of the net there by Thomas. As he's trying to find the loose puck behind the goal, Bishop will fire it around. Brousseau is not going to keep it in. Brousseau from his own end will move it over there to the other side. Trying to fire it off the boards. It comes in here for Russo. Ethan Sterling from his own end will fire it around the other side. <clears throat> Drops it back to the line for Rennie with a shot that gets chipped out. Rolling all the way down the ice into the York Simco end. Using that boards, that'll get knocked down by Bishop to hit uh, Martin there at the Toro's bench. Martin. Trying to get around Arda for an opportunity. Cuts to the face-off circle but loses it to Bishop. Back to the line it goes. That goes over the stick and into the corner. Trying to chip it around there is Sterling. Thrown to the net. Stopped there this time by Christian Thomas. Out of front here for Baker to try and find the puck. Skating away now is Keaton Arda. Arda tries to get away on the other side. Setting up in front. And that'll go in wider than that. Kept in here by Zane Dwyer at the line. Legacy trying to help out there behind the net. Keaton Legacy doing the battle over there. Kicked off the boards and out. Nolan Lee trying to chip it off the boards there for Keaton Legacy. It's away there for York Simcoe. With a lead pass through center that gets knocked down by Dwyer. Chipped into the zone from the face-off circle. Tries to shoot it. And that one is stopped there by Thomas. Face-off off to the left of the goal. A quick shot that gets knocked down on the way through. Trying to find it there with Zane Dwyer in his own. Coming around the other side here for Lee to try and chip it out past Swirla. Nolan Lee lost control of the puck now. Walking out is Nicholson from behind the net. Nicholson back to the line. Trying to shoot it. Couldn't do it. Puts it into the corner. Walking out on his own. Taken away. And it's going to be Keaton Legacy from his own end. Legacy lost control of the puck now. Picked up by Dwyer. St. Dwyer fans on the first opportunity. Now flips it away. DeBow couldn't go with the puck there out of his own end. Picked up now by Forget. Forget drops for Swirla. And then that pass over there for Forget was out of the reach. 
Back up the other way, they're coming, but it's gonna be a tourist penalty as Forget is down. Back in behind the net. Martin trying to jam it in from the side. It gets stopped there by Thomas out in front. Face off off to the left now of Thomas. Fired around by Bishop and gets knocked down on the way through. It's going to be Bell. Bell a shot. That's a good stop there by Thomas. Face off off to the right. Over there to the other side. Trying to fire it. Couldn't do so. That was Brousseau. Behind the net is Hudson Bishop. Bishop tries to fire it around there for boys to try and go now. He gets hooked down with no penalty. That rolls into the York Simcoe end. Taken aside there by the Toros. Shot to the front of the net that goes wide by Jackman. Scooped up by York Simcoe out of their own end. That is Russo who chips it to himself. Here comes an opportunity now. And he walks in and puts it in to make it 6-2. But it's going to be a penalty coming up. So no goal, it's his interference. Face off off to the left of the York Simcoe end. Skating it away with it, is bringing it in is Stewart taking it to the goal, gets stopped there by Thomas, right in close, and then a quick whistle at the side of the net. Face off off to the left of the Toro's end. Rolling into Shaw, or to Thomas who makes a stop. Face off off to the right of the goal, one there by York Simco, but it goes past Rennie and out. Legacy trying to stick to his man. Keaton Legacy tripped up there at center. Trying to find that puck again as Legacy on the other side. Chipped in there by Owen Dobbs back in behind the net. Skating away through center. It is going to be Taken wide and behind the net, there's a shot that gets stopped by Thomas. Still trying to get it out. Back to the line for McCauley. McCauley puts it deep in behind the toes net where Dwyer tries to get it. Sterling fires it around here for Dobbs. Owen oh, Dobbs' pass is knocked down there by Martin. Man coming out of the box. Knocked down there by number 11 on his way through to the net. Bounces off the boards here for Martin. Martin trying to get around. St. Dwyer is going to stuff it out in front, but nobody can convert. Back up the other way they come. It's going to be Owen Dobbs who fires it deep behind the net and goes off on the change. DeBow taking it behind the goal. Walking it in front. It gets stopped there by Arniatis. Our daughter take the draw here. Nolan Lee trying to stick to his man, Swirla. And Hudson Bishop is right up there against Swirler as well. Bumps him off the puck. Getting it over there now for Lee. There'll be a turnover there in the zone. Back and behind the net goes Swirler. Bishop from his own end. Trying to clear it over there to the other side for Brandt. Off the boards it goes. Knocked down here by Keaton Arda. And it's offside. Face off just outside the blue line where Riley Brandt. Tries to put it in the zone. Goes back in behind the net to try and get it back to the line. Brandt picks it up again and works on the wall. Riley Brandt trying to get away from the checker. Puts it behind the net for Arda. He's not going to get to the puck though. As it's Bruce so he moves it there to the other side for Bell. Trying to get it back to the line there for McCaslin. Can't do it. Dwyer is able to flip it in. Over here to the other side now for Nicholson. Nicholson trying to get away from the checker against DeBow who comes back nicely on defense and pokes it away from him. Dwyer with a lead pass now for Riley Brandt when another lead pass now from behind the net it's Forget. Forget's pass is knocked down here by Dwyer as he tries to put it in. Knocked down here by McCaslin on the way through. Over here for Adam Baker. Baker trying to put it in the zone. Taking it wide. Trying to take it to the front of the net. Drop for Jackman. Ethan Jackman had it knocked off its stick though. 
Coming in now is Swirler into the zone. Fires it hard off the boards, back in behind the toes net. Five minutes exactly left to go. York Simcoe holding on to a 5-2 to two lead here in the game. Getting it over there for Adam Baker, who can't get it out of his own end. McCaslin was getting held up. Rennie with a shot wide of the goal. From behind, Kadeklo tries to use a glass to get it out. Got it up there for Baker, and now for Jackman. Ethan Jackman trying to get away here. Out of the corner, he walks to the front of the net, gets stopped there by Arniatis. Face off off to the left of the York Simcoe end. Coming around the boys to try and get it out of his own zone with a lead pass, trying to split the defense. Ethan Sterling's coming back to try and control him. Nice play there by him to fire it around the boards now for boys to try and chip it out. Gets kept in there from the blue line. Legacy trying to do the work on the other side. Kept in here by McCauley with a shot. Stopped there by Thomas. From behind the net now. It is Sterling getting stripped out the puck. Walking out, there's a shot stopped by Thomas at the side of the net. Tripped off the puck there was Legacy. Round the boards, kept in by McCauley. Over there to the other side, looking for the shot to the front of the net. It's going to be an opportunity to skate it through center and use the boards to get it up. Not past McCauley, though, who held it in. Around the boards it goes. Kept in here from the line by Dobbs. Dobbs doing the job here against Russo to try and dig it free, and we get a whistle. So we get that puck there is Riley Brant. Brant tried to get through. Held up by Dodd, trying to keep it in there from the blue line. Here on the other side to bring it in now is number 13, Murray. Murray, drop pass to the line. A shot that gets tipped wide. Bishop trying to stick to it and fire it over there for Blake DeBow who can't get it out of his own end. Now it's Bishop hard around the boards against DeBow. Arda trying to get away from the checker. It's a turnover there to number 15 who backhands it in. It's going to roll right into Thomas for an easy save. Face off off to the right. Zane Dwyer takes it from behind the goal. Dwyer tries to chip it around the other side. From behind the net, they try and set it up in front for Nicholson. It'll be a pass out in front to try and find it. It gets kept in there by the line by Bruce Sard. They're looking back to the line for Bruce Bruce a shot. That's a nice blocker save there by Thomas. From behind again now for Zane Dwyer to try and get it out of his own end. Dwyer with a lead pass now for Arda. Keaton Ardo with a lead pass now for Blake DeBow. DeBow is coming in. Had it knocked away off a stick at the last second. Around the boards kept in here by Bishop. DeBow doing the job here with Riley Brandt on the right side. From behind the net it goes. DeBow trying to set it up in the front. Now to be forget with a pass. Trying to cut in here into the center zone around Bishop. They've got Swirla at the side, picked off by McCaslin. Lead pass for DeBow was over his stick. Blake DeBow backhands that one away, gets knocked down on the way through. Trying to find the puck on the other side now. Brought in here by Nicholson with a shot. Easy blocker saved there for Thomas. Sterling fires it around, kept in here from the line. Shot will go in wide of the net. Rennie taking McCaslin down. There's a bouncing shot with a left pad save there. Kadiklo with a puck to try and get around. Can't get it past the defense. Moving it to the other side now for Adam Baker over his stick there at center. Sterling from his own end. Trying to get it up there for Kadiklo. Got taken off his stick. Back up the other way. It's going to be McCaslin trying to pick it up there against Russo. Russo trying to stick to his man over here to the other side for Kadiklo. 30 seconds left to go here in the game. Out in front, taken aside by the toes, and they'll lead it out of their own end. McMullen tried to hold him up there at center. Ethan Sterling 
tried to put it deep in here for Adam Baker. It goes behind the net. Baker tried to get Jackman out of front. He got tangled up. Back in behind the net it goes with a battle there in the corner. We're getting a whistle. Nine seconds left. We'll have one more face off here. York Simcoe are going to win this one. Five to two over the Toros. The Toros got themselves into some penalty trouble and York Simcoe scored at least probably three power play goals. So refereeing was kind of one-sided in this one, but it's a disappointing loss here for the Toros. They uh, have one win and two losses in this three-game stretch, and this will prepare them now for Thursday night when they're going to play Barry and then have the Oshawa Cup going on for the next weekend. Thank you for watching on this Sunday evening. I'm the voice of the MJ Broadcasting, Mike Jackman, with the video done by Bar Down Style.